In example 14, and the last one in this topic, uh, we are expected to find the range of values of k for which x squared uh, plus 4x plus k is equals to 0 has two distinct real solution. The condition is has two distinct clear meaning clear has two clear um, solutions or roots for that matter and you know the nature of the discriminant again will determine um, it will determine when we have two distinct roots and what is our discriminant for this condition to be fulfilled the discriminant b squared minus 4ac it has to be greater than 0 and you can already see our a in this particular equation is 1 our b is 4 and our c is k so let let us substitute all these here and have our b which is 4 squared minus 4 times 1 times k which is c all of this put together have to be greater than zero what is this giving us 16 minus 4k has to be greater than zero and it goes without saying what we are simply saying is that 16 is greater than 4k if you happen to divide by 4 on both sides in an attempt to clean up this uh, equation, then we are simply having 4 has to be greater than k. Or for this to be realized, our value of k has to be less than 4. If this particular function has to have two distinct roots, our value of k has to be less than 4. And that is just what we are expected to do because it is being realized from the nature of discriminant. When it is greater than zero, then we expect two distinct solutions or two distinct roots. So that is it. And I'm hoping that we have exhausted everything uh, in that particular uh, topic two in quadratics, pure mathematics one. In case you have a problem, please tag me up and um, uh, let's see how we can help out each other. All right.